Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if your Wi-Fi connection does not have a valid IP configuration. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search icon. And this tutorial is on Windows 11, by the way. So open up the search menu, type in settings, best result, check on back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to go and select the three horizontal lines up at the top to open up the navigation panel. And you want to go down and select where it says network and internet near the top. So go ahead and left click on that. On the right side, go down to advanced network settings. Go ahead and open that up. And then select underneath more settings, network reset, reset all network adapters to factory settings. So this will remove and then reinstall all of your network adapters and set other networking components back to their original settings. You might need to reinstall other networking software afterwards, such as VPN client software or virtual switches. Your PC will be restarted. So make sure you have your Wi-Fi code nearby because once we slot the reset now button, we will have to restart within the next five minutes. And if you want to get back online once you restart, you will need to have your Wi-Fi code. So just go ahead and select reset now. It's going to prompt you, are you sure you want to reset your network settings? Go ahead and select yes. And at this point, we're going to select close. And then you're going to close out of here. And we're going to go restart our device. So hopefully I was able to resolve your problem, guys. Another thing we could try if you're still having a problem would be to open up the search icon. Search for device manager. Best result, should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to expand the network adapter section, so double click on it. And then right click on your network connection and select uninstall device. Select uninstall. And then once you've done that, close out of here and then you will restart your computer. And assuming you're Adapters built in should automatically detect it once your computer restarts. Same for a Wi-Fi plug and go, like a USB connected adapter as well. So go ahead and restart it. Make sure your adapter is connected if it's an external dongle connected adapter, perhaps if you have an older style computer. But just give it a moment here. Most computers running Windows 11 honestly should be pretty modern, but you know, time will tell. I don't want to date this video too much by, you know, talking about the system requirements for Windows 11 as of today, but pretty straightforward process, guys. Hopefully that was able to resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.